kind of a font of trivial knowledge. Like you, he would test you at any time, any place, on any level of um, minutia as far as like whatever he wanted to ask you. He's we, we nicknamed him after uh, Cliffy, after Cliff Clavin from Cheers. <laughs> uh, it definitely fit. <laughs> Lovely. We will uh, get back to the game, and Vanessa, you'll select first. Let's finish Dr. Mittens for 200. <laughs> <laughs> Ultrasound won't tell us litter size. For that, we use this diagnostic technology that's several decades older. You'd use x-ray for that, Vanessa. Coffee break, 200. There are more than 600 coffee farms on the Kona coast of this U.S. island. Ryan. That's Hawaii? Yes. Uh, coffee break for four. Order Café Com Leche in Brazil and you'll get coffee with this liquid hot. Or sometimes this liquid with a little coffee. Ryan. There's milk? Yes. Let's try Ballpark Fun for four. In an unexpected crossover, the green fanatic supporting this team since 1978 has a kid's book with a Galapagos gang of animals. Vanessa. Who are the Phillies? <sighs> yes, the Philadelphia Phillies. <laughs> <laughs> coffee break, 600. It was a fine coffee named for a Yemeni port before it was a chocolatey coffee flavor. Vanessa. What is mocha? Correct. Coffee 800. A Seattle coffee company is named for this 1765 British act that raised tea prices. Coffee was soon the patriotic choice for colonists. Ryan. What is the Stamp Act? Yes. Uh, ballpark fund for six. There's a daily double. They're in the lead with 3,800. Have faith in yourself. What would you like to wager? Uh, hmm, thousand. Here's your clue. <laughs> Traditionally, home fans of this AL East team give particular emphasis to yelling, oh, during the national anthem. Who are the Baltimore Orioles? That's correct. Brings you to 4,800. Select again. Uh, ballpark fun for eight. When a Texas Ranger hits a homer at home, the theme from this Robert Redford film plays, and it's not the way we were. Megan. What is the natural? Yes. Uh, U.S. government history for 600. 1930s Smoot Hawley Act raised these import duties. Anyone? Anyone? By about anyone? 20% rattling Wall Street badly. Ryan. What is alcohol? No. Tariffs. Megan. U.S. government history for 200. In 1989, he became the first African-American chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff. Ryan. Who's Colin Powell? Yes. Uh, ballpark fund for a thousand. In the 1980s and 90s, this rhymingly named Cubs announcer led the Wrigley faithful in singing Take Me Out to the Ball Game. Megan. Who is Harry Carey? Correct. U.S. government history for 800. Big from 1834 to 1854, this political party took its name from a British one opposed to royal prerogatives. Ryan. What are the Tories? No. Vanessa. Who are the Whigs? That's it. <sighs> Coffee break, a thousand. Temperate at an altitude of about 5,000 feet, Medellin is a center of this nation's coffee industry. Megan. What is Colombia? Yes. U.S. government history for a thousand. On March 1st, 2003, FEMA and 21 other organizations got a new boss with the creation of this department. Megan. What is the Department of Homeland Security? Yes, and here's the final clue. After Yankees win, the Yankees win at home. Count on hearing this Sinatra classic on the stadium speakers. Ryan. What is New York, New York? That is correct. It's the end of the Jeopardy round. It's a close game. <laughs> Double Jeopardy is up next. Welcome back. Megan, you are in the lead, and Vanessa and Ryan.